Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Wrapped X here with Good Clean Gaming RX, and today we are back in Boundless, where it appears to be snowing. Um, there is white everywhere. All right, uh, I'm going to go ahead and check on my furnace. Good. Uh, we've got the sackcloth. We've got the glue. I believe we just need a few sticks now. Uh, inventory, handcraft, components, sticks, perfect. Let's go ahead and craft four of those. Um, and go ahead and jump into our workbench here. And we've got our two copper tools. So we can use those now, and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to craft a copper swift sling bow, um, because I really want one of those, just so I can do a little bit better damage uh, when I'm hunting the different animals. Okay, so, uh, warp conduits, we need two of those for making this next uh, objective. So I'm going to go ahead and see about making those. Let's go ahead and go into our, oh, let's see here, recipes, stone furnace, warp conduits. Let's go ahead and go to, no, imagery journal, here we go. All right, mountain high, cave deep. Warp conduits. There we are. Drops from meteorite. Or recipe. Crafting time instant. Any rock and any trunk. Yeah. Perfect. Well. Let's make some of those then. Rocks and trunks. Let's go ahead and uh, equip our Tree. There we go. We'll go ahead and equip our tools here. Let's use our copper one right there and our stone or copper axe right there. Good. And see about going and chopping down some of these trees, which should go much faster. Not quite sure if it's going really any faster, but it's definitely uh, requiring a little bit less energy to actually do this, so that's a very nice feature. should have enough there, so we'll go ahead and we should be able to craft these now, handcraft, components, beacons and fuels, warp conduit, perfect. Let's go ahead and one, two, four, five, six, navigate lower. Let's go ahead and open our 
journal here. Navigate lower, I'm not exactly sure. <laughs> Poop and place warp conduits. Okay. Let's uh, let's go ahead and place a couple of these. Let's go into our inventory here. Uh, warp conduit. We'll go ahead and put those right there. And uh, we want to make sure we're doing this inside of our territory. Here we go. Good. Uh, let's go ahead and place one right there. Perfect. Okay. Nomadic light landing site. Capital. Open warp. This is 28. Well, let's go ahead and do that. Perfect. All right, we've got. What? Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> so, wait a minute. Where's Where's the capital here now? Oh, uh, probably right over there. Okay. Well. I guess we'll go ahead and see about making a couple more beacons. It seems to be rather easy to make those. Alright, and we'll see about uh, placing, well, see if there's anything over here worth worth mining while we're over here. Yeah, let's see here. I don't really, oh, there's some soft coal over there. Let's go ahead and, we'll go ahead and get that. There we go, very nice. That's, uh, that's a decent amount of coal there. Let's go check and see. Ooh, looks like there's more over here. Where is it? Right over here. Ooh, a little bit right there too. See if we can go ahead and get up here too. Very good. Very nice. How many is that? Soft coal, 13. Very nice. Alright, I'd say that's a pretty decent amount. Let's go ahead and uh, 
make ourselves a nice little beacon and we'll head back home. Alright, we'll go ahead and get into our inventory here. Handcraft, warp conduits. Let's see, I think we can probably just make these. Oop, hello, where'd they go? There we are, perfect. Let's see here, one, two. Landing side. Open warp. go. Now I wonder... Open a warp to your beacon. There we go. That should do it, I would think. Oh, hello. not. Now where? Where's my house? I'm, I'm hoping this is it. Otherwise I'm going to be hopelessly lost. <laughs> yes, there we go. Okay. Interesting. That's not too bad. Now I suppose the question is how does one how does one place these so that they are stuck there, you know, so that so that it doesn't disappear whenever you create it. I'm sure there's probably some sort of technology or something behind it that allows it to do that, but uh, we'll have to research that at a different time. Alright, so, I think my sling bow is probably finished. Let's go ahead and get into there. Contents, very nice. We'll go ahead and go there. And equip that, and we're going to move it up to here. Alright. Let's see about... Okay. There we go. All right. Let's see. Hmm. There are no animals for me to hunt. Where have they all wandered off to? And then perhaps it's just because it's night time. But I really don't see... And nor do I know what all these little red icons are on the, on the taskbar there, or on the, on the navigation bar. Ooh. Looks like there's another little beacon here. Noss's first beacon. Oh, and there. Hang on. Where are they all at? Right over there, I guess. It's going to be a bit of a climb to get over there. one. Alright, let's get in a good spot here. Ah. 
Very nice, two bones. Perfect, that's what I needed. Right, let's see. I can definitely tell that it's uh, that it's much faster. Tinted burst fungus. Hmm. Several different items added there. jump over there. I think I should be able to climb up here without too much difficulty. There we go. Perfect. All right. There we go, perfect. That's another bone. Very good. We'll be able to make ourselves some more glue. See if we can find a good spot here, actually. Let's go ahead and eat another one of our yams here. That'll do it for us. We're going to go ahead and see about getting back to our house, which it looks like it's going to be a little bit of a swim. We'll go ahead and just hop off here and swim around, I think.
hide, a bone, two raw meat, and one tallow. Boy, those stout ones have got a little bit more of a kick to them. Ooh, another person's. Warp conduit. Some storage blocks. Very nice. Alright, we'll go ahead and head back to our house. Good. All right. So next, uh, I'm going to see about. Uh, well, I guess we should see about making ourselves some more tools. Was the, uh, the at least the crafting or augments? Any base metal? Fresh vital essence. Ooh, okay. So I think we can get into here. Inventory four. Ah, oh, no, we've used it. Okay, let's go ahead and get into there, and we're going to go ahead and put go ahead and put two of those into there. We've got plenty of sap and plenty of bones, so we can make more glue. We've got our fresh vital essence. So, there we go. There's our copper ore, or copper bar, sorry. Uh, let's go ahead, and I think... There we go. We can make our warp augment to the first one. There we go. And that'll go ahead and make that. It's going to take two minutes. Interesting. Ink. Oh, that's inky leaf. Okay. Uh, what else can we make? Syrup. We really need to see about making. Ooh. Really need to see about making some more of these tools. So. Let's see what we can make next in here. Woods, rocks, metals, alloys, vegetation, components, crafting devices. There we go. Okay, the mixer, ancient tech remnants, three base metal. Let's see about getting some more of these, and then we'll, we'll make one of those mixers. Whoa, yeah, there's quite a bit there. Gold alloy. Spark link, spark generator. An iron furnace base, any base metal ancient tech, yeah, oh, oh my, yeah, there's going to be quite a bit before we can do that. So, let's go ahead and get this mixer. We've got the stones, we just need the base metal and the ancient tech remnants. So, it's daytime again. Let's go ahead and see about finding, whew, lush world, placid, that would be a nice one to navigate to in a little bit. Let's see about finding small tech remnants. There we go. There's a few. Whoa, whoa. 
Ooh, and some more coal there too. We'll have to come back and get that. Oops. <laughs> okay, how many do we get there? One? Alright, we're going to need to find another one then. We'll go ahead and get a little bit of this coal. Just so that we've got a little extra there. Very good. Oh my, it is snowing. Good. We'll go ahead and there we go. Perfect. Let's go ahead and create this mixer. Um, mixer. There we go. Perfect. There's our warp augment. we can actually create our first let's see if we've got builder let's see here I'm sure there's an explorer Beacons or settlements list in the places menu. Okay. Places. Interesting. Let's go ahead and do that. menu okay so we'll go ahead and hit the options menu return to the sanctum And there we 
we go. <laughs> oh, come on, there's got to be more. Trader, miner. just want hmm. interesting should have our uh, mixer finished now. We'll go ahead and get that out of here. Contents, oh, Q, mixer, oh, no, that's three minutes. All right, well, that will have to be it for today then. I am going to go ahead though and open a, wait a minute, where'd the world go? Marks, there we go. I'm going to go ahead and do this. So I want to see about opening up a hole to pick location. Save the warp location. Okay. So, I believe we can now go ahead and set up our warp conduits. And go locations, warp destination, marks, open warp. And we'll have our first warp. Discovered marks. Very, very nice. Oh, those are owned. All right. Well, interesting. Blocks cannot be broken. Oh boy. Yeah, this is. There we go. Well, we've definitely got plenty of boulders around. This is very interesting. Very nice. Alright, well, I think we will leave it right here <laughs> for today. So I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone. Take care, and I will see you guys later. Ta-ta.